I'm Christy Rochette, and I've got Brendan here, Battenfelder, correct? Correct. Yes, I'm from Christy. Badger Realty. Yes. And it's so nice to have you on the show. Thank you. And you guys have a, a good, uh, strong vacation market, but it also seems like you have uh, some of the locals coming your way as well we recently. We certainly have. We've had a really busy summer. It's been exciting. We've uh, The vacation market continues to plug along and be a strong part of our business. Uh, but we've had a, a really good influx of people deciding to move here yeah. and come from all across the country and come and buy houses. Yeah. Uh, so that's been really exciting to see is new families coming into town, looking at the schools, looking at the different neighborhoods. Yeah, we've got a lot of transplants. I'm a transplant. So. Yeah, I, I am too. I'm from Pennsylvania. So, there we go. Uh, you know, it's a beautiful place to live. And, uh, and then we also certainly have seen a lot of locals, uh, others from renters to going to first time home buyers. Yeah. We've seen um, people trading up for just more space for their family. Yeah. Uh, and we've seen certainly plenty of people looking to downsize wow. uh, and maybe look for one level living. So, exactly. Uh, all those options, op you know, that's creating a lot of movement in the market uh, besides just people coming and going from the valley. So. Nice. And, uh, and so You've had a busy summer season, I imagine, yeah. and I imagine that will probably continue into the foliage season. It does. We have a really busy fall season. Uh, we were talking about that before we got on air about how it is, we will see demand run all the way through into the holidays, through yeah. Thanksgiving, through Christmas. Um, the ski buyers are starting to look right now so they can be in for a, a ski home. Yeah. And it's still a great opportunity to sell a house. There's a lot of demand out there still circling on the market. So whether you're a buyer or a seller, it's it's a good time right now to be looking if you're interested in yep. buying and potentially looking to list your home if you're interested in selling, even if it's as far ahead as looking into spring season. Certainly, and so if, if you're looking at something, a transition now in the fall, there's still plenty of demand. There's still, even though it might get a little quieter on the streets, there's still a lot of people out there looking online and looking to make that transition, some of them being ski buyers. Yep. Um, or even if you're having a consideration that maybe 2020 is a good time for you to either downsize or move or what have you, we're happy to start that conversation now yeah. and uh, start to talk to you about what might need to happen to your house uh, before we put it on the market. Exactly, because there's a lot of things that you don't realize that need to be done before something like that takes certainly, place. Certainly, certainly. The, the list can be longer than you anticipate it to be. It can be, and there will be things that you may not be able to address in February. Exactly. That you can address now. Exactly. Um, there's some, you know, the painters are pretty slammed right now, but there's still some opportunity to get some exterior work done on your house. Exactly. Before before we go into and then you can hit the market before many of the others who haven't had that opportunity to yeah. do the prep work in yeah. the spring um, so still a slamming market uh, still the phone is ringing off the hooks we still have properties that are multiple offers going under agreement in three days wow. uh, which is which is crazy for us I mean you know the, over the last few years this has probably been the last year maybe year and a half that we've really seen this demand wow. um, and it's been great for the valley uh, prices continue to climb uh, in the region, which has its pros and cons. Yep. You know, it's a benefit for those who are selling. Uh, certainly, we've seen plenty who are buying, um, who are concerned and maybe are, you know, are getting priced out of some of the things they really want to yeah. look for. But uh, overall, it's been an exciting market for homeowners yeah. um, in this valley as we've recovered from years ago. Yeah, exactly. And uh, and so. Do you have any particular, you were mentioning there's some new construction happening uh, there as is. well. There is. We've, had, we've seen a lot of new construction. We represent quite a few builders that work in the valley, but um, Saco River Run over on 302 towards Freiburg has had a, a great boom uh, for this past year. Yeah. And uh, the preserve in Bamfield Hollow in Madison, okay. uh, Old Farm Road uh, down across the street from Banners is looking at new construction with beautiful nice. views. And uh, so we're, we're seeing that demand either from retirees, vacation home buyers, or families looking to just uh, maybe size up yeah. and, and do a little bit bigger house. Yeah. So we're seeing new housing starts uh, definitely grow this year. And some of the features that people love about this area, not just the mountains, but the rivers, and you're mentioning a really beautiful uh, listing that you had right on Peabody River. Yep. Over yep. in Gorham, right? Over in Gorham. So uh, 111 Glen Road, a beautiful house overlooking the Peabody River. Um, and that house is currently on the market right now for 325, and uh, we've seen a lot of activity. Uh, Gorham's a gem, uh, you know, a beautiful uh, area that a lot of people maybe don't look past the Mount Washington Valley yeah. per se to go up over the notch. Um, and we've have we certainly we have listings from you know Ossipee all the way up through. We have an office in Berlin, so we cover the whole North Country, wow. um, and then many of us are licensed in Maine as well. 
And I have to say, I drive through the notch regularly, yeah. one of the notches, and the drives through the notch, I mean, you never get tired of right. it. I've been doing so it for three gorgeous. years now, and uh, you get absolutely no distractions, uh, right. and you just have beautiful s scenery all around you, and it, it's almost um, humbling. Yeah, to see, you yeah. know, when you go through the mountains. So uh, I have to say, I'm a fan <laughs> of driving through the notch. And sometimes you get to see wildlife. Certainly, <laughs> certainly. Uh, hopefully the moose isn't in front of your car. <laughs> right, right. You get to see them as you buzz by. Like yeah, exactly. Um, and uh, usually you know because uh, if you're not the first one to spot them, like the cars will the all cars. be parked on the right. side of the road and you're like, what's Classic. everyone looking at? Oh, right. I'm going to get a picture. Um, and then uh, we've got a couple ways to contact you. We've certainly. got a, a couple numbers and then we've got the online resource of course, badgerrealty.com, um, and I, you probably can do justice for the numbers better, better than I will. <laughs> so certainly anyone can reach us at our office yep. at 603-356-5757, uh, so that's our office number, yep. um, and that's a great way to reach out to us as a start. Uh, if you want to reach out to me personally, my cell phone is 603-722-0359. Um, so that's not a bad way to reach out to me and just start a conversation about what you're looking for or, or are we considering uh, listing a house. Um, and then you can always start the journey without talking to someone um, by just exploring ideas on badgerrealty.com. Yeah. Um, so there's a lot of ways to reach out to us and there's many of us out there that are happy to help. Awesome. It's so, been so nice having you on the show. Is there anything we didn't touch upon? I think we, we touched upon everything we wanted to talk about unless there's anything you can no, think of I, on the I'm spot. I'm just really excited that we've had such a great busy summer. Uh, we've got a lot of great families that have picked up new homes this summer, and we've been posting those on Facebook and congrat congratulating them. Um, awesome. It's really exciting. A lot of families that have come up and, and seen new opportunities um, and new condos, new homes that they're going to enjoy for years. So yeah. it's, been, uh, it's been a fun summer, and it's going to be a great fall. Whether it's you're living here or you're vacationing here, it's a very special place to be. It is. Yeah. It is. And we just see a lot of energy, and we see a lot of people making that decision to invest here in the Valley because they want to. Exactly. Um, and, and that's exciting for yeah. us. Yeah. And, uh, of course, you guys are on social media. You mentioned Facebook. Yep. So uh, we can find you on, on Facebook as well. We can find us on Facebook. You can look for Badger Realty. You can look for Brendan Battenfelder um, on Facebook, and okay. you can find us. Um, and that's an opportunity to connect with us as well. Awesome. Well, it's been so awesome having you on the Thank show. Thank you so much. Thanks for helping so many people come to the Valley. Thank you. Um, and make sure you stay tuned. We'll be back for more on White Mountains Today.